This machine can move at least 10,000 tons of German coal a day. It is the Rolls-Royce of mining equipment, developed by the Eikhoff company in North Rhine-Westphalia. And here in the Ruhr Valley is the Augusta Victoria coal mine. The miners are just coming off shift. In many cases, their fathers and grandfathers worked here as well. But for these miners, the future looks bleak. The mines will close in 2018 at the latest, and many will have to look for new jobs. We visited the Eikhoff company in Bochum. It manufactures the equipment the miners use every day. Some of the well-educated miners have already found new work with Eikhoff. Herr Kutziner, until recently you worked in the mining industry and now you're here. Why? I wanted to change careers. I no longer saw a future in the German mining industry. Personally, I give it a maximum of 10 years. I'm 40 now, and I'm at an age when I could be laid off. Assembly of this 50-ton monster will be finished in a few days. Soon it will be cutting 20,000 tons of coal a day in a Chinese mine. Wolfgang Schröter has been in mining for a long time. Now he is responsible for Eikhoff's Chinese business. Are your customers waiting? Of course. We'll dispatch this machine at the end of March and it'll be put straight to work. The production section is waiting for it. China's mining industry is experiencing an incredible boom. They need coal, so consequently they also need our machines. We learned that 95% of the production goes abroad, to China, Russia and Australia in particular. Due to the crisis in the German mining industry, Eikhoff decided to concentrate on foreign business a long time ago. The employees make almost all of the parts here, some to an accuracy of a thousandth of a millimeter. Some 300 mechanics, technicians and engineers work in the company's mining section. Paul Rheinländer is head of the almost 150-year-old family business. He wants to ensure that with its specialist equipment, Eikhoff remains a market leader in the face of international competition. The industry is booming, and as a German company, we try, by taking great care, to ensure that German engineering leads the way. And here you can see what I mean. Complex electronic equipment like this is able to withstand shocks, heat, oil, water, dust, and anything else. At the heart of the machine are some extremely complicated electronics. It runs on a voltage 500 times higher than that used in private homes. Engineers and technicians are constantly developing new variants on mining equipment in the company's construction department. They have to satisfy customer requirements from countries as diverse as Russia and Australia. And this is essential because only 5% of the machines are sold in Germany. All the same, the German mining industry remains important. The German mining industry is extremely important to us. This is where we test new developments, under extremely difficult conditions. And if it works here, it will work all over the world. The machines, which often work at great depths, will soon be used increasingly in India, the next big thing. <laughs> 